Well, well, well. Kylian Mbappe to Real Madrid. It's official now, guys. Yesterday, he was unveiled at the Santiago Bernabeu along with 85,000 Real Madrid fans. And he took the number nine jersey from Florentino Perez, guys. And what a dream come true for Mbappe it is. He's following the footsteps of his idol, Cristiano Ronaldo, who similarly took number nine jersey when he first entered Real Madrid. And not just that, guys. Even during Ronaldo's presentation, there were 85,000 fans. Even Mbappe's had 85,000 fans. What a coincidence. And hopefully, Mbappe can recreate the career of Ronaldo in Real Madrid once again. You know, winning loads of trophies, winning loads of Champions Leagues. I wish he scores loads of goals, guys. And what a player it is, guys. He's undoubtedly one of the top three players right now. Today, guys, I'm going to be making the best possible Real Madrid team. I mean, the present free Real Madrid team, obviously. And also, there are a couple of rumored players which I'm going to be putting in the starting 11 as well. So, yeah, let's begin the show, guys. This might probably be the modern Galacticos team, guys. First, let's start by putting in Kylian Mbappe in the Real Madrid team, Mbappe in the striker portion. Wow, this card is amazing and I want to replace this Mbappe card with the Real Madrid version in the future. 155 pace, 138 shooting, 103 passing, 114 dribbling and 110 physical. And also guys, let me make Kylian Mbappe with jersey number 9. So let's go to team editing. I got to go to the locker room and number. For him, I'm going to be giving him number 9 guys. It's a done deal now. Here we go guys. He's looking cool in the Real Madrid jersey with the number 9 as well. Who the left wing and right wings are going to be? You all know who it is guys. It's the Brazilian talents, Vinicius Jr. wearing the number 7 and Rodrigo. I'm not sure what number he wears normally, but yeah, let's go get Vinicius Jr. and Rodrigo up front. So they are going to be the attack force, guys. And also, there's a backup striker for Real Madrid, Endrick. He's the backup striker, but I don't think there's a card for him in FC Mobile right now. So I'm just going to go with the left wing, right wing. So let's go get them both. And I'm sure, you know, Vinicius got a left wing team of the season card, which I'm going to be putting in. Uh, so yeah, here we go. He's got this ultimate team of the season card and he's going for, I'm going to get the max short card, guys. Or maybe yeah let's just get the three rank card you know so 379 million coins for the four rank card sorry and yeah that's the one and in the right wing of course we have the champions league version of uh, a brazilian right wing rodrigo this no this card was normally just 93 or 94 but he got upgraded all the way up to 97 because real madrid won the champions league so let's go get this 139 million coin card that's gonna be the right wing and what a juicy attack it is this is the modern galacticos team undoubtedly guys the purchase of vinnie jr is done we're waiting for rodrigo and rodrigo Rodrigo purchase is also done. Now let's go and you know unite the future of Real Madrid attack. So here we go and Rodrigo welcome to the team and I think Real Madrid are sorted with the attack guys for the next six to seven seasons minimum. All of them youngsters maybe. Mbappe is the only oldest one, uh, elder one out of these three attackers but wow what a talent guys. Bo all the three players they're just too talented and let's use the skill points on this guy Rodrigo. Rodrigo has got one or two pace guys and with dexterity and round duter he's gonna be even more faster and by the way you know this guy is quite versatile guys he scored crucial goals for real madrid all the time and also he can play as a striker and he can also play as a left wing player so 115 pace uh, for this non-trained rodrigo card guys that's not at all bad and next we got vinicius jr and yeah even he's a speed king 107 pace for him without using any skill points as well i'm gonna make him a round duter as well even he's played a striker sometimes 120 pace 99 shooting 113 dribbling amazing card now it's time to move on to the midfield uh before that you know what let's start back from the goalkeeper guys in the goalkeeper we all know who it is it is Thibaut Courtois he's in his 30s now but still I think you know goalkeepers normally have a long career so I think he's, he's gonna be in Real Madrid for a few more seasons to go so he's only got 92 rated card guys he's got a striker guard but we can't use striker for this team so we gotta go with this card instead and I'm gonna get his max short card for 67 million coins I think uh, EA should release some new Courtois card guys apart from the striker card you know we need a goalkeeper Courtois card high rated as well because he deserves it guys I know he's been injured for most of the season but still he's Courtois and moving on to the left back so real madrid are strongly rumored to sign this left back it's not official though guys it's just rumors so yeah as i told earlier this might be the potential real madrid team uh in the coming days so in the left back the rumored left back is anthony davis guys so this guy is the rumored left back so yeah i'm gonna get this card for 40.9 million coins so here we go that's gonna be the left back they already got a left back in mendy but he's injury prone i mean yeah but still you know he's a great left back though but real madrid are strongly link to signing davis so i wish if if it's done this is definitely going to be a galacticos 11 next we've got the center back in the center back you know there's adam Militao, guys who's so young and very good as well already he's amazing center back and yeah this is the card i'm going to be going for 174 million coins by the way this real madrid team has got loads of brazilians guys and the next center back antonio rudiger guys that's the next center back so wonderful player by the way another wonderful player so 240 million coins for this guy so that's 
that's the center back and coming to the right back i haven't seen any real madrid rumors uh you know that they're close to signing any right back but you know we have experienced right back here danny carvajal i think he can still play for one more season he's old guys as far as you remember he's uh 30 oh never mind i think he's got a few more years in him i thought i don't know why but i thought he's like 36 or 37 but still i think he's got a few years in him for sure he's gonna be the right back very experienced and you know he's a serial winner guys euros uh, champions league he's won it all now that's the right back so all the purchases were successful apart from the davies card so you know what apart from him i'm gonna claim the rest and let me just put them in the team guys first we're gonna begin with the goalkeeper Thiba Kotua. welcome to the team Thiba Kotua. so yeah that's the goalkeeper and let me just use his skill points guys uh so he's got five skill points i'm gonna use it on diving goalkeeper passing shot stopper so here we go this is how i use all my five uh you know uh, skill points and the stats are not great obviously because this is a very old card it's from the rivals event so yeah that's like six months or five months ago so moving on to the right back we got danny carvajal amazing right back card by the way i use this guy but i sold him very recently so let's use the skill points of him on defending and no nonsense full back and yep that's done not at all bad next we've got the center back we got a ucl center back another ucl card uh which is rudiger and then let me just put Adam Militao in the center back position as well so welcome to the team Adam Militao wow this team is gonna be scary from next season guys it's gonna be even more scarier i know tony cruz got retired but still this they still have luca modric they still have experience in the team guys so they also got david alaba you know they've got depth guys that's for sure so i'm gonna boost his defending no nonsense center back as well so yeah that's how it goes 118 defense 110 physical 94 pace look at those stats crazy good stats guys and next we've got Adam Militao so i'm gonna use his skill points on defending and no nonsense center back here we go another crazy good card 120 defense 103 physical 92 pace so that is fantastic card now it's time to move on to the midfield and in the midfield we all know one player that's definitely going to be there which is Jude Bellingham so this season he was one of the top scorers for Real Madrid and also one of the favorites to win the Ballon d'Or I think he's like one or um, he's in first second third positions potentially Vinicius might be uh, winning the Ballon d'Or so anyways this is the card all green color stats all stats above 110 apart from the defending and physical crazy good card by the way guys I love this card and also I love the card design so the next sentiment I think we should go with Valverde guys obviously yeah I totally forgot about Valverde he's gonna be the next midfielder and by the way guys the Davis purchase is also done just on time so let's go put him in the left back position and welcome to the modern Galacticos Davis I'm gonna use the skill points four skill points he's got on defending no nonsense fullback he's, he's already good in attacking and stuff guys but he's got to get better in the defending section yeah now his defense is much better and also this is one of the most beautiful card designs in the game but there are only one or two cards I guess Phil Ford and Davis are the only cards with this card design as far as you remember but anyways let's go get Valverde guys and by the way I'm not sure if you're observing or not but we already reached 98 OVR we still have to put two more positions in so let me just get Valverde so even he's got 90 yeah 90 rated card crazy good card by the way even this is an overpowered card 326 million coins for this one or three rated Valverde and next I think we need CDM and Cam I think there's Chiamani and also Luka Modric there's experience and there's youngster as well and also this Arda Guner by the way guys how can I forget him even he's the future of Real Madrid you know what let me just put it on Real Madrid in general we can just purchase the players that we need from here so this is a 99 Valverde card but I'm just gonna go with the 90 rated card instead so there's this uh, center forward Vinicius card but I don't think he's gonna play uh, in the striker portion or center forward portion anymore because Mbappe has arrived we can go with Luka Modric that's for sure 90 rated Luka Modric card I'm gonna go for this one instead of his Euros moments card uh, yeah because this is on a Real Madrid kit obviously so I'm gonna go with this one not just that I think I'm gonna get Chomany as well yeah Kamavinga I totally forgot about Kamavinga as well he's the future he's definitely part of the Galacticos team but you know what yeah I'm, I'm gonna get him as well 105 million coins for this Kamavinga card and he's gonna be the next one where is Chomany guys let me just search with the name now even he's a fantastic player oh never mind he's only got 88 rated card I'm just gonna skip him guys I hope the Real Madrid fans don't mind it and also guys Arda Guder has got a 98 rated card you know what I'm gonna add him in the bench you know why not let's just put him in the bench he's going for 343 million coins so let's go get him this euros in turkey he shined guys he shined well so yeah great player once again so let me just claim all these players lots of uh, potential the real Madrid team has got guys they've got one of the best youngsters uh so anyways let me just put luka modric here oh you know for now i'm just gonna put uh gula uh, and uh, let me just put this uh sentiment which is uh valverde let me just put in the bench as well one or three ovr we made guys by the way not at all bad but we have to put in kamavinga i think with kamavinga oh it didn't drop I thought it's gonna go to one or two but it didn't so let me just put on Luka Modric as well where is Luka Modric here we go Luka Modric so apart from Kamavinga and 96 set in Mendy rest all players are in the team so yeah this is the Galacticos Real Madrid team guys anyways let's go uh, you know 
know, have fun with this team in a heavyweight match now. All right, guys. So I found an opponent, and he's got 876,000 trophies, and not just that, his attack, midfield, and defense, everything is at 101. So rating wise, also, he's got a great team. But let's go, guys. I'm gonna try to win this match with a good margin. By the way, guys, I've assigned every player in the Real Madrid kit number in the jersey number. This is my opponent team. That's a nice team, and this is our Real Madrid Galacticos team. I'm excited, guys. Vinny Junior, back to Bellingham. Okay, that is good passing. Good passing. Come on. Come on. That is nice. Oh, Van Dyke with a crucial tackle there. Okay, Waller. Oh my god, plenty of space he's got now. Ooh, Rodrigo scores the first goal of the match, but not my Rodrigo. It's my opponent's Rodrigo that scores the goal. So that's bad, guys. I got to defend well. Okay, Bellingham. Bellingham still has the ball. Oh, come on, Bellingham. Shoot it. And Bellingham scores. So, oh, I should have just let him celebrate, guys. I'm not sure if he's got the new celebration, though. Uh, but anyways, he gets the goal. That is good. Let's go and score and get into the lead, guys. Okay, Bellingham. Nice pass to Rodrigo. That is an excellent pass, guys. Oh, my God. What a pass. And Mbappe just couldn't finish it. But what a pass that was from Rodrigo. We almost scored the second goal right before the halftime. But I should have not used a lot of power while shooting. But that's fine. We got another half, guys. And yeah, it's the end of the first half. Not a bad first half, honestly. I know I considered a goal. But I tried my best to score uh, two goals. In the next half, I'm definitely going to come back, guys. Winnie to Mbappe. Mbappe. That is nice. Mbappe, come on, shoot it. Oh, wow. That was beautiful. And that's the second goal of the match, guys. Look at that. Look at that. The Bremer got stunned there. And yeah, one-on-one -on -one with the keeper. And he's never missing that shot. 2-1. We take the lead, guys. Okay, let him just pass it backwards. That's fine. Oh, wow. Good idea from my opponent. Oh, no, 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 no. He equalized, guys. So it's 2 on now. Got to score another one. Ooh, what a pass. What a pass that was. Oh, it's a foul by me. That's a foul by me. Yeah, I know that. Hey, Van Dyke is taking the free kick. Oh, what was that? That was a foul. You said we just pushed my player. Oh, but this is a foul. Come on. Come on, ref. You should be on my side, not their side. Wow. That was a beautiful free kick by my opponent. Almost score there. Rudiger, come on. That's a good clearance by Rudiger. What was that? Jude Billingham scores now. Not my Jude Billingham. It's my opponent. Jude Billingham that scored the goal. But you know what? We are running out of time. He's just keeping the ball. Thank God. Courtois does a save there. Come on, Mbappe. Unleash your pace. But Mbappe looks tired, guys. He looks tired. He's getting outpaced by Bremer. Nah, that's full time, guys. I lost the match, guys. That is unacceptable. But you know what? I tried my best. I gave my best. And even my opponent was a good player. That's it, guys. I hope you all have enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to subscribe to my channel and go watch this video next.